Today is a lake day. I'm up early. I have to prep my food because if you go to a body of water without food or even like a jug of water, you're doing it wrong. You have to have food at the beach, at the lake, at the pool, wherever you go, obviously. I mean, I need it. Make a sandwich because it has to be a sandwich for me and pack some other stuff. Come along with me to prep for the lake and then come along with me to the lake. Got this big, delicious, what are you? French bread. I love this bread for sandwiches. Yeah, it's kind of bready inside, but I really like it. But if you want to, you can just like carve out some of the bread like on the top. It's not bringing this entire thing. So I've got to do some trimming. Last time I made a sandwich for the beach, it barely fit in my cooler. So I'm gonna be smart this time and I'm gonna measure. That should be good. Cut off a little knutch, left this big old baby for some other time. Another sandwich perhaps. I'm gonna try not to cut it all the way through. So we'll see how this goes, but right in half. I think I cut it too much, whatever. See what I mean about the big kind of bread in here? You can carve some out if you want to, but I like it, so I'm gonna keep it. Today I'm going kind of simple, but it's one of my favorite sandwiches. It's every Italian that I get, Genoa salami, American cheese, and extra pickles. But I usually get salt, pepper, oil. Today I wanted mayo. For some reason, I'm feeling it. And I'm a Hellman's girl, so if you're not, look away. Obviously suggest not using mayo if you are going to be out in the sun with this, but I have a cooler, so mayo it is. If not, definitely go with the oil and maybe some red wine vinegar. I bet that would be delicious. Season all the layers. Oh, it's gonna rip in half. Oh well. I'll still eat it. Salt and pepper. Delicious American cheese. That's Genoa salami. I love Genoa. It is the only kind of salami, especially when it's very thin. I always go to the deli and I say, please cut it as thin as possible without shaving it. This is the good stuff. And then pickles. These are the most delicious pickles. It is a Stonewall Kitchen brand, Tillin Farms. They call them, oh, I guess they do call them cornichons down here, but they really, they're pickled baby cucumbers, but they're cornichons. They're so good. If I don't have these, I'll go with the dill. But I love these little pickles and I'm not even gonna chop them, slice them. I'm just gonna throw them on because they're tiny, but I want a lot of them. Have I mentioned that I love pickles? <laughs> Maybe I should do a tad bit more cheese to hold it on. And while I'm at it, maybe a couple more slices of salami. You can never have enough, right? So I'm just gonna lay it on there so everything is sandwiched. <laughs> Get it? Sandwiched in. Now to try to close this thing. That's a sandwich right there. Delicious. Now I'm gonna wrap her up. I never know how to wrap these things quite right. I guess I'll try it this way. Ugh. I can double it up if I need to. There's my delicious sandwich, ready for the cooler. I prepped some stuff last night, so really I'm just going to fill up my cooler, get my water ready, and I should be good to go. Ice bag. I'm gonna put my sandwich at the bottom here next to the ice. Fruit. I have some grapes in here, strawberries and pineapple. Fruit at the beach, it's just, it hits different. My mom always freezes the grapes and that's always so delicious, especially when you're hot. So you should definitely try freezing your grapes. They are so good. Chips. These are the Utz Ripple Cheddar and Sour Cream. They are so good you have to try they don't always have these at my store but when i see them i get this bag and whenever i get Utz chips it just reminds me of mad men which reminds me of don draper which makes me very happy so there's that and i think that's all i had 
close her up. Got my big old water jug. This is very important to me. I am a crazy person when it comes to water. So I like need to have a ton of it at all times. So she's getting filled up. I have a bathing suit on. I'm not naked, I promise. I wouldn't put that on the internet. Unless you wanna pay me. Just kidding. <laughs> water. Fill to the brim. Ice cold water. Water, food, I think I'm good. I have my bags back here. Extra clothes always must bring in my beach bag with my towels, book, sunscreen, and a blanket. Hats, if you're a sensitive person like myself. It's gonna be a fun day. So I'll see you at the lake. That sandwich was unbelievable. Highly recommend. Had some chips and some fruit. Perfect. It is so hot, but I'm here. It's summer. It's toasty. Like a salsa, it had like green peppers. On a sandwich? I don't know what it was. Dad! home now. I just took a shower, ice cold shower. It was so hot today. I was feeling like an actual swamp creature. That was my day at the lake with some friends and it was just a good day and I had lots of yummy food. Perfect. A little bit of a different video today. I thought it would just be fun to share what I like to bring to the beach. What do you like to bring to the beach? That's what I want to know. Hope you enjoyed. Bye!